that goes from the back of your sinuses up to the ear equalizes the pressure. As anybody knows when they have flown on a plane or been diving, that you can feel that pressure and feel that pop. Most people, it does it automatically without any effort, but a large majority, a large portion, I will say, not majority, a large portion of people can't equalize. Up to this point, the only solution we have was to have them try and force it. Do it's called a Valsalva maneuver, uh, trying nasal sprays. And in worst case scenarios, we frequently do a tube, uh, just like you would for a child that has ear infections. None of those solutions are really that satisfactory. And a lot of people found that the tubes are just as uncomfortable. The balloon now, we're able to use that to put actually into the eustachian tube and dilate it. So it's a more natural fix and again, minimal downtime.